Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. Before we start, please like this video and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the bell icon. Thanks. Prince Harry will continue to tell all in two new interviews, both of which you can tune in to this weekend. The Duke of Sussex will make separate appearances with CBS's Anderson Cooper and ITV's Tom Bradby, speaking on the issues that prompted his 2020 leave from his senior royal duties, as well as topics in his soon-to-be-released memoir, Spare, just days ahead of the book's release. Prince Harry is under the spotlight again after preview clips from another high-profile interview aired, with one commentator labeling him Meghan Markle's puppet. It is one of two interviews with Prince Harry to air this weekend ahead of the release of his tell-all memoir, Spare. It has been a busy few weeks for the Sussexes, who also released a Netflix docuseries last month, raking in 88 million viewing hours in just four days. But according to Niall Gardner, a foreign policy analyst and former aide to Margaret Thatcher, Harry's ongoing media campaign is nothing more than a hit job on the royal family. Niall Gardner former aide to Margaret Thatcher, called Prince Harry and Meghan Markle two of the most anti-British propagandists in the world. On CBS's 60 Minutes, Harry explains why he decided to publicly break his silence in response to what he claims to be a cruel misinformation campaign spearheaded by Buckingham Palace against him and his wife, Duchess Meghan. Every single time I've tried to resolve issues, privately, there have been briefings and leakings and planting of stories against me and my wife," he says to Cooper in a preview clip, later adding, there comes a point where silence is betrayal. Mr. Gardner also tweeted, Harry's stunning decline since joining Meghan Markle's vicious campaign to destroy the royal family has been tragic. Despite the blowback, Harry's highly anticipated memoir, Spare, is said to become a bestseller. It is released on January 10. The autobiography has already spent weeks near the top of the Amazon book's sales charts based on advance orders, with the title at No. 5 in the UK listings on Sunday. The couple signed a $1.20 million four-book deal with Penguin Random House in 2021, and there has recently been unsubstantiated speculation that a memoir by Meghan might form part of the publication series. The couple made a number of accusations against the royal family in Britain. The most explosive claims relate to racism within the firm and British media. Throughout his 90-minute ITV special, Prince Harry, the interview, Harry opens up about his estranged relationship with his family, as well as if he sees himself ever returning to his senior royal duties in London. I want a family, not an institution, he tells Bradby. I would like to get my father back. I would like to have my brother back. Ahead. See where and when to tune in to both bombshell interviews this weekend. So what do you think about this news, guys? Please, share your personal opinion with us in the comments section below. Thank you.